Greetings friends and welcome to Enigma Night Gaming. My name is Liara and I will be your guide in today's adventure. Today we're playing Shadows of Doubt and we're trying to solve the mystery of the generational murderer. Now, we started this case in our last episode, but it feels like there's no leads anywhere. How are we going to find this, this killer? All we have is a fingerprint. Well, let's hop in and see if we can follow any leads at all. Alright, so we're at the scene of the murder. Um, if you'll remember, we found this little car, and the car has um, a fingerprint, right? So, where is my car? The car has a fingerprint, BZ, um, which is not whoever it was not our murder victim right um so we've been trying to figure out how can we track down the fingerprint um and so far i haven't really had any luck but i did have a few ideas so one thing we could try oops i'm sorry sir please don't shoot me um one thing we can do is we can check the fingerprints on both the mailboxes and possibly the neighbors, right? And see if we get any hits. So even if the neighbors won't give us their fingerprints, we might can get fingerprints from, um, from their doors, right? I just ran all the way down. I could probably take the elevator at this point, but I think by the time it got to me, I'd already be downstairs. Whoopsie daisy. All right. We got one more floor. All right, now, nobody's around. Let's just start checking mailboxes. See if we can get any kind of fingerprints on these mailboxes. Anything at all? There's a fingerprint. CK. Um, there's not a whole lot of fingerprints on these mailboxes. They're mighty wiped clean. CL. CM. We'll just keep keep exploring. CO. CP. Uh, CQ. CR. I think we're getting closer. We might actually make a hit. CS. Wait, BZ. Is that the one I'm looking for? Let me see. What is the fingerprint I'm looking for? BZ. Aha. Okay. So, you are 1101. Alright, well, let's see if whoever lives at 1101 is our killer. Alright, 1101, where are you at? Right here. Alright, let's see who you are. You are definitely our suspect. Do you have anything on your doorknob, I wonder? Any, any fingerprints on your doorknob? Oh, there's a fingerprint. Hmm, Ayush Kelkar? Maybe. Maybe you're someone who lives with them. We'll have to see. You were just coming to the door. Excuse me. Why? I'm confused. Well, I want to um, check the fingerprints over here. Maybe somebody was trying to... I think these are all somebody else. Okay. What about over here? Oh, are you finally opening the door? Hi. Uh, okay, so it's not you, but it may be the person you live with. Um, hi, can I come and look around? 
You're welcome. Come on in. Okay, you are definitely innocent of crimes. All right. Do you live with somebody? That is the question. Um, let's look around. What do we have in here? Um, anything. It's very sparse here. All right, so let's see what we got here. Ayush Kelkar, that's this guy, right? All right, so I don't think it's, it's not him, but maybe he lives with someone? Does he? I don't know, let's look at his files. I'm not seeing anything. You have no files. What in the world, sir? Well, we can always check if the computer has two accounts, right? And at least see. That is a weird placed doorknob. Uh, is this your files? Oh, okay. So, Ayush Kilkar. That's your eye doctor. Okay, tenancy agreement. Really? You're the only one who lives here? Hmm. Okay. Is it possible it was somebody who is your neighbor then? Did we get anything here? This is the one where we got all the C Y or C Ts, right? Um, this one, Shun Peng. We'll see. We'll, we'll investigate all these. If if none of this pans out, we'll go back to the mailbox and see. I mean, we very clearly found the fingerprints. Um, hi. Uh, have you seen or heard anything unusual? What do I look like a newspaper? No, I haven't. Okay. Um, as if I tell you. Um, but can I come in and look around? I don't invite Riff Raff. I'm not Riff Raff. I'm a detective trying to solve a murder. Excuse you. Sorry, no. Can't trust anyone these days. I mean, you're not going to trust me as soon as you let me in because I'm going to try and get my credits back. Don't want you snooping around my things. As if I... Really? Do we... Do we know your fingerprint. Your fingerprint is not even the right one. What are you being so suspicious about? Do you know something I don't know? Okay, fine. I had to pay 400 to come in. That's crazy. I hope this is worth my while, sir. I will take that paper clip. Okay, who are you? BF. Okay, He's so you don't he have. Years, okay. Give or take, so back you had nothing empire. either. You know, it seems like this were popular. I don't the understand why you were so resistant to me coming in there. <laughs> now, Lieutenant, Chess mate. I'm no common born broker. We got the key now. Yeah, and I'm no art critic. But here we are, drinking from the same bottle. All right. There's Can I get no any of my coins back? Starch candy. Paperclip. Uh, Air pin. Just collecting up on all the lock picking things. We already got the key. Uh, in my chemical. Where did our other person work? You worked where? Oh, you worked at the sink clinic. Okay. I don't know what you. Uh, you, you have to excuse There's me, money then. there. I want to come back and get it. Are y'all just having a stare down? New rejuvenation clinic opening soon. Customers by nomination only. All right, what else Contact do we got in here? To find out more. Uh, anything in here? Uh, yes. That was a lot. Count backwards from seven. All right. Uh, ring. More money. We got a lot of 
medicines. Anything interesting in your files? I assume it's neither one are the ones I'm looking for, right? So this is Andrew Murphy. Oh, wait. Emily Wagner. Okay. And Andrew Murphy. Okay. Wait, three... Three of you live here. What? Hold on, hold on. Oh, wait. Maybe that was update for something else. I don't know. Alright, so this is Shun Peng. Andrew Murphy. Okay, so it is just two people. Okay. Hmm. Is it count backwards? Nope. That was the other one. Do we have a note here? We don't. What does this say? Can I take this? You're not coming in, right? Doink. I don't know what you're talking about. I didn't take any money. Um. Hi. Just having a relaxing evening, huh? While someone snoops about your house. It's totally fine. Nothing to worry about here. Alright. We got anything in here? Anything interesting? Uh, you work at City Hall. What's... Surprised I haven't run into you. Also surprised that your wife is kind of a pest. Yeah, you heard me. I said a pest. Alright, can I get over here and see? Oops, I did not mean to do that. Can I uh, get rid of this comb? I don't need the comb. I meant to close the drawer. <laughs> it's just gonna fall on the floor. Alright, this chair is like getting annoying. Let's set it down. Alright. Uh, yes, please. Alright, well, it's not everything I need, but it'll have to do. Let's go back down to the mailboxes and look, okay? And see... So we very clearly found the fingerprint, but maybe it was on a neighboring uh, mailbox. And they're kind of in weird order, so it doesn't necessarily mean anything. It could also mean the killer just walked by and put their fingerprints all over the mailbox. I mean, that's a possibility, too. But... Alright, so where did we find it? It was... CS was right here. But let's see. Can we find any other fingerprints? It's directly on this one, but maybe it could be for 404. And see, it's like weird. It's like 404 and then 1101. It doesn't make any sense. Hmm. Do we have any kind of fingerprints around here? Not seeing any. Only one I saw was right there, which was 1101. Well, we could try the one right below it. All right, 404. Let's see. What's at 404? Four oh three. Four oh four. Okay. Let's see if we can get any fingerprints on the door. What do we got here? C W C X, but it's B we want, right? B B Z. Okay, so probably not you. Three oh four. Where is three oh four? Four, right here. We got any kind of 
No, I didn't think so. All right, let's go. I think it's got to be on the 11th floor. 1101. All right, so we are here. Oops. Um, I really want to see, uh, let's go ahead and pin your phone book just so we can look at it. Um, I already have your fingerprint. I really feel like it's somebody that lives with you, but nobody seems to live with you. You seem to be all by yourself. Which is just weird. I mean, we got the key now. But I, I really don't know. Well, let's see. Where in the world is the... There's the light. I was like, where's the light? Do you have anything in your fridge? Ooh, you have some food. I will take that, thank you. And then I will be out of your hair. Bye bye Thank you for letting me visit. Now I'm going to eat this. Alright. Let's eat our food while we think about what to do next, right? So, could it be 1102? I don't think we went in here, right? Hmm. Alright. So let's see. Can we go in here? Nobody is, uh opening the door, so I wonder if we can, let's see, we're doing nothing, hi, absolutely nothing, there is definitely no law breaking going on here, nope, I'm just crouching over here for funsies, promise, definitely not breaking the law, Definitely didn't pick the lock. Or open the door. Who are you? Andrew Murphy. We already know your, your print. You're fine. Alright, so. Are you home? I don't know. You have a laser in your room, which kind of says you might not be home. Let's see. We got anything in here? Are you just moving in? Hmm. We got anything in here? We got some files. Any, no files yet. So nobody's in here. Alright. Um, I really want to know who even you are. Alright, I think this is clear. Uh, what is this? Set of calligraphy? Okay. I don't know who you are, but I'm robbing you because I need money. You could be completely innocent. All right. Um, let's see. Olivia Peterson. All right. So Olivia Peterson lives here. Okay. Do we know anything about you? We need to find out some more about you. I, I don't know. But let's see if we can find anything out. First off, I want to check fingerprints on here. If you live alone, CT, so it's probably not you then. <gasps> hmm. I am unsure. This one also has a laser in it. Hmm. I am unsure what to make of this setup. 
Do we have any fingerprints on this door? Any at all? There's a fingerprint. CT. Yeah, it seems like it's you're not our person. So I have broken into your house and stolen your money for nothing. I apologize. Alright, well... I guess I'll be on my way then. Alright, so... That was a dead end, but... Um, so I don't think you're going to help because your fingerprint is probably CT, if I have to guess. But we have this address book. Um, is there anything similar between his address book where I found the fingerprint and this guy? Um, so let's see. We have 501 Gatto Building. That could be a lead, maybe? Maybe? Okay, so the only one that I saw that was in common was 501 Gatto Building? I don't know. We can check it out. 501. Alright, what kind of fingerprints we got here? Ariane Poli. Flinch. Um, AV. Okay, so it's not going to be either one of you guys. Alright, so that does not pan out. Hmm. Alright, well, um, I guess we head back to Wang Heights and see what else we got. I mean, we could check the mailboxes here for fingerprints, I suppose, just to see, but I, I, I'm guessing it's probably going to be someone at Wang Heights, right? Do we have uh, fingerprints anywhere that would be someone besides yours? Andrew Murphy. Why would Andrew Murphy's fingerprint be there? Whose phone's ringing? I heard a phone. Hi. Um, do you know this person? Um, her. They were on Wing Heights. Uh, have you seen or heard anything unusual? Nothing springs to mind. Goodbye, I guess. Bye. I mean, you're very cooperative, so I, I feel like a little bad about doing anything else with you. All right, let's check 1203, I guess. That was the other one. But I'm really not sure what we're going to find. I hope we don't have to wait for the killer to strike again. That's what I'm hoping to avoid. 1203. We got any fingerprints here? These are all DU, DB. Yeah, none of these are who we need, right? Risa, Kojima, DW. Hmm, what about here? DX. We've gone through like a whole letter of alphabets and still haven't found the right person. It's crazy. What is that supposed to be? Interesting. And and you don't have any fingerprints anywhere else on your door, right? That aren't yours? They're all yours, right? We'll just kind of be a bit thorough and see. I really would like to know how you were reaching up here, sir. You're like extremely short. That's um, impressive, to be honest. But yeah, as far as I can tell, he lives alone. We haven't found anyone's fingerprints here that match. Hmm. Well, 
what about actual legitimate next door neighbors? Like maybe someone that was actually on the 15th floor um, is the neighbor. Maybe we could we could see. I mean, I'm a bit skeptical, but sometime at some point in time, this person touched this guy's mailbox for some reason. I don't know why. Alright. Can we uh, get any fingerprints over here? DZ. Wasn't DZ elsewhere? Like, on the floor lower? I feel like it was. And why are there fingerprints down here? Were you crawling to your door? EB. Nothing but EVs. Yeah, it seems like this person lives alone. Hmm. I mean, I want to go in and, like, I really just want to check the door. Yeah, it's just the people we know. Mm. We're not getting any other fingerprints besides people who are supposed to be here. DZ. Hi. Don't mind me. I'm just taking fingerprints. I'm not breaking the law, I promise. Not yet, anyways. Maybe eventually, but right now, no. Right now, I am not. Alright, so where else have we not searched? Um, I, 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 I don't know. I'm baffled. I thought for sure 1101 would give us some, uh, some hints, but maybe, maybe we can find a weapons dealer in this basement. Let's see, let's go down, I guess, and look and see. Maybe we can at least narrow down a suspect list. All right, what do we got? We got basements. What does that say? F-R-G, what is this supposed to be like? Froster or Frosty maybe? Interesting. <laughs> moon? Oh, moon? I don't know. Stork? So, um, the reason why I am checking out the graffiti is supposedly... So we came across an arms dealer before. But the password, they asked for a password and we had no idea. Supposedly, the password is supposed to be on the graffiti. Now, I don't know. We'll have to see. Hi, can I come in and look around? You're welcome to, come on in, thank you. Um, wow, you have a nice place here. It's very simple. You're very nice. One of the few nice people out there. Well, I want to chat with you, though. Um, do you, what's your name? Celine Johannesson. Okay. Uh, do you know this person? I saw them somewhere around Barry Terrace. Hmm. Okay, why would you have been around Barry Terrace? I wonder. Because that's not... Let me look at the map. I don't think that's near where she worked, right? Barry Terrace. Where is that at? Um, Barry Terrace. I don't see it. Is it one of the buildings, perhaps? It might be one of the buildings. 
let's see, maybe if I, I don't know, I don't know. Bear Terrace, though, do you have anyone in the address book who is at Bear Terrace? Let's look. You do have this person. You could maybe check that out. I mean, it's just as good a lead as anything else, really. I'm just curious if we get any... I don't know that there is an arms dealer down here. There may not be. We have to find one. And it doesn't look like we're finding one. So that's okay. Um, I guess... I guess we can go... What, what did you lose? Uh, between floors 10 and 14. What is it? Lipstick? Okay, just as a little side check because the generational hunter is giving me a headache. We're gonna go look between floors 10 and... Wait, what? Where am I? I must have come out of the wrong building. Where is this? Interesting. This is like a side door. Okay. Uh, a side door to wing uh, heights? Where do we go in at? Interesting. So you have to go in through here? Um, but you can't go up anymore, right? Or, yeah, you can't go up anymore. Oh, you gotta come over here. Okay, okay. I mean, it's sad to say, but what do we got? What is that? That's like a battery, right? I don't think it's a lipstick. But we'll look around for a lipstick. Somebody lost a lipstick, and they're going to offer a reward, so sure, we'll look for it. Why not? Because I can actually go in the echelon zone, so why not? That, I think, is an eraser, yeah. Alright, we're still looking. And do we see a lipstick anywhere? There is a lipstick. Okay, um, is this the one that's lost? Let's see. Uh, last seen at Wang Heights between floors. If found, re return to Ford Culpepper. Okay, sure. All right, sure. Why not? We'll we'll just we'll just do this uh, for fun, just because. All right, so let's take it. And then, um, let's head. Where are you at? We'll have to, where, where do we turn it? Or staff at Olive Ward. Okay. Well, let's head there. Just, just because I haven't done one of these lost item things, I think that's kind of cool. Hello? There's nobody here. Hello? There's not even anyone here. Whose computer is this? Wait, whose computer is this? Ford Culpepper. Okay, so... Uh, Ocean Cunningham? Okay. Well, let's see. Uh, who are you? Hi, what's your name? None of your business. Okay, fine. I mean, I suppose that's fair. I did just randomly come in here. Um, government database. Let's look him up. We have his first and last name. Culpepper. Alright. DY. Okay, we don't need his printed citizen file anymore since we now have all his information. Can we get your address? 
1201 Wang Heights. Suspicious. And just because I can, we're gonna check your fingerprints. Fort, Fort Culpepper and DX. Whoever DX is. Alright. Well, let's see. Maybe we can find him. And I don't know why Ford Culpepper would have lipstick, but we're not going to ask questions. Hi. Uh, let's see. Here's a lipstick. Glad to get this back. Thanks. Alright. Nice! We got some social credit. Do you know this person? Okay. Well, I just helped you, but sure, whatever. You do you. Alright, um, what do we do now? We did that. That was a fun little side quest. We did find out a little bit more about uh, Ekron's neighbors. But what do we do now? Um, alright. Let's see if Louise is here and we can talk to her. Maybe she can help us figure some things out. Hi, what's your name? Mind your own business. Is your name Louise? Have you seen or heard anything usual? No, I mind my own business. Mind your own business. <laughs> I mean, I'm trying to... Nothing to do with you. Uh, it is to do with me. Can I come in and look around? Not a chance. Okay. Uh, make it worth your while. I don't invite Riff Raff. Come on. Now I feel like you're hiding something. I'd rather you didn't. I mean, I'm going to keep going up in price until I'm broke. You guys drive a hard bargain, though. Sure, you don't mind for 400 You weirdo. Alright. Well, well, let's look around and see what we got. Um, what do we got? Who, who are you? Louise Meyer. Okay. So we have her picture, which was not you. You're like somebody else, right? Uh, dirty plate. Why do y'all have dirty plates? That's gross. Should wash them. Uh, Louise Meyer. Let's take the key. And I'm sorry, but you drive a hard bargain, so I need my money back. Alright, let's look around. Really? We have some guns here. What kind of fingerprints we got on these? Yay. We're getting phone calls. DZ. Alright. Um, let's... What else do we got? Work Rota. Um, Elgin Beauty Bible. Shopping list. You got anything in your fridge? I really need something to drink. Ooh, you got a cola. Thank you. I will be drinking the cola. Alright. It will quench the thirst. Such gross sounds, though. My goodness. Oh, we got an achievement for returning that uh, lipstick. Nice. Alright. Um... Got any food in here? Any real food? Yes, you do. Man, y'all are just loaded up. We'll take care of all of our needs here. I'm gonna get the full use of my 400. Alright. Dispose of it. Now let's check this. Uh, Josh O'Connor. Okay. Yes, please. All right. Anything else around here? 
We've got assorted books. Who just came home? Oh, you're the you're the short cranky guy. Okay. I mean, you can keep Oh, hey. You're the one I want to talk to. Um, do you know Ekrin? That's my neighbor Ekrin Batar. And uh, they they've been working at Adam Street Sink Clinic. Yes, I know. I saw them today around 1:15 a.m. Okay. All right, goodbye. 1:15. What time did she die? Um okay, so she saw her just before she died. All right. What fingerprints we got over here? Probably not our killers if I had to take a guess. Easy. Okay. Um Anything useful in here? Another key. Y'all got a lot of keys around here. Uh, small ceramic jar. Any files? In we do have files in there. This is your rental agreement. Employment agreement. Just the eye doctors. Tenancy. Another tenancy. I mean, y'all are doing perfectly fine money-wise. Okay. Well, we got a lot of information. Y'all have a very interesting choice of wallpaper, I must say. It's out this way. It feels like y'all are just moving in. There's a lot of bedrooms here. Is this like a guest room? I don't know. Seems kind of like it. What you got here? Where are y'all? I don't know. Uh, 3210. You got lots of sync disks. I'm not gonna steal your sync disks. I am going to take all of his money because he was rude. Hearing aid? You have a hearing aid? Why do you have multiple files? Okay, you just haven't moved them here yet. Okay. Well, nothing new learned here, unfortunately. You could have just told me, you know. I wonder. Can you get, like, a fingerprint? Can you, uh, I wonder, can you search? Without him knowing? He has no fingerprint? What if you do it like that? Nope, it doesn't work? Okay. Either way, I don't think you have the right fingerprints anyway, so you're fine. Hmm. Okay, so that one doesn't really pan out. Um, what about Neil? Okay, so he was at 1603, so he's just up a flight. Let me go talk to him and see what he has to say. Will be, he be home? I think we've tried to talk to him before, and he was not there. So we tried to track him down on his work, and that didn't work either. So let's see. Uh, hi? You're type Y, okay. Uh, can I come in? As if I'd let someone like you in. Um, okay. Do you know... Do you know your neighbor? Or do you know the person who lives here? Yeah, that's Neil Davies. Um, does he, is he home? They work at that place, Python Value Hardware. They live with me. Is he home? They're here right now. Okay, okay, good. Can I, um, can I come in? Sorry, but no. Please! Oh my goodness, you people are making it so difficult. Sure. Yeah, okay. 
I mean, I just got a guest pass. Thank you. Rude. Locking me out right after you give me a guest pass. Alright, what do we got here? Battery, eraser. A katana. Why is there a katana here? I feel like you got all these people who are like so close to being able to commit murder. What other, any other fingerprints around here? Nope, those are all like just, just yours. Your security guard, do you use that uh, katana in your security guard work? We will, will we be yoinking your key? Yes, we will. And your money. We almost got all our money back from uh, what we paid you. Alright. You're not in here either. So we will be yoinking that. Let's see. Do you have a fingerprint on here, I wonder? Neil Davies. Hi. I want to go find Neil Davies. Work Rhoda. Alright. Can we find him? He's probably... You're just walking around in circles, my guy. Okay, so you're sleeping. Can we take your fingerprint? Can we search you? You have nothing. Remember your passcode? 0451? I don't know if we'll need that. Business card. Python value hardware? Okay. Alright. That is a very interesting way to sleep, sir. Hi. Alright, so, can you tell me about... I didn't even ask if you knew who it was, and you're already telling me none of your business? Really? You're not going to tell me anything. You're very rude. Now I'm suspicious. I'm not paying you anything right now. I'm going to, like, find fingerprints. Oh, we already know your fingerprint. Your fingerprint is not it. I forgot. I forgot. Well, he's not cooperative. Do any of your neighbors have suspicious fingerprints? No. About here. Alright. Hmm. Alright. Well, what are we supposed to do now? Well, let me actually, let me look at the map for a second. Right? Let's go down, uh, I, down, up one floor. And now, let's see if we can find, because I know I have seen a weapons shop somewhere. I just don't remember where. What was this? Useful home improvements. Uh, black market trader. I mean, I guess we could try this, right? Useful home improvement. We'll, we'll give it a shot. I, I don't expect it to be uh, very helpful, but... Useful home improvement is better than nothing. Nobody seems to be here. What kind of... Uh, Oh. Hi. Uh, I know the password. Okay. So we need a password. What would the password be? Um, is it somewhere here? Is it... What would it be? There's all kinds of graffiti. There's... Would it be cold? Um... I don't know. We 
We could try that. Because I'm not sure what else it would be. Um, okay, let's try the password. Let's try Colt. I don't know. Nope, not it. Okay. Nice try. Uh, what about the other one we saw? Was it Jezzy? Nope, not it. Okay. Hmm. Can we read anything from this? Um, that one's really hard to read. Alright, well, I think we head to the model diner and we get something to eat and uh, pick up a new case until the murderer strikes again because I I don't know where to go with this. We can look and see if we see... Oh, wait, there it is. What does that say? Rosemary? Now I have the password. Alright, I know the password. Rosemary. Is it Rose Army? Because it was kind of hard to see. Let's let's see. Rose Army. Really? All right. I know the password. Let's try. Rose Mary. All right. Let's try it as two words. Yes, yes, yes. I know. I'm going to need the password. We'll try it as two different words. Alright, so, and just for case sensitivity, we'll try it this way. Not it. Okay, so this must be the password for a different place then. I guess we're just gonna have, I think the case has kind of gone cold. We're just gonna have to wait for something else to happen. Alright, let's go ahead and get some food. <laughs> Fried chicken. <laughs> Let's get our typical cop, cop fare. Get our donut. We need our coffee and our donut. And just because I can, I want to check all of your fingerprints. No other reason than, you know... Lovely e-girl, what? Wait, what? Belongs to Lonely Girl. That's hilarious. Okay. EJ. Let's see. Because you never know. I might get lucky and hit a jackpot. I mean, that one was CQ, which is somebody I've run into before. Yeah, not this time, though. Alright, now let's check the jobs. What jobs do we got? Outsource to rest. Handcuffs required. Suspect may be armed and dangerous. Okay. I want to get the one with the most reward. That one was 1850. Uh, this is 2050. So far, that one's the winner. 4300. Okay. We're definitely going to go for that one, I think. Demolition work. Uh, no questions. Public humiliation. Anger issues. Photography, uh, work available, almost 1250, 1550. Alright, I want to go for this one. 4300. It's probably going to have like no information, isn't it? Alright. What are we supposed to do with this? Oh, we already know the guy? Uh, handcuffs required. Suspect details available. Okay. Jonathan Hawkins. Okay. Well, off to City Hall I go then. Alright. Hawkins? I think I already know you, right? Yeah, like, I'm pretty sure I already know you. I don't know what you're under arrest for, but sure. Uh, can I not pin this? I could pin this. Not sure why I can't pin that, but... 
Oh, because it's this. Maybe. Alright. Um, is this like supposed to be a different person? I think it'll be yeah, it's the same the same dude. Alright. Well, let's uh let's um yeah, everything is matching that we do know about him. Alright, so let's go find him. 302 Bianchi building. Alright, somebody is coming. No key under the door. Hi. May I help you? Oh, how convenient. Alright, well, we are arresting you. Done. Alright, so. Uh, do you have anything on you? You have nothing on you. So, let's see. We have arrested you. Uh, identify the suspect. I mean, you told me who it was, so sure. And arrest the suspect. Plot route to hand in. Um. Let's see. I don't know. Bye! Yep, I see you. Bye! Have fun. We're off to City Hall. You can pursue me all you want. Good luck doing it with handcuffs. Alright. Alright, now we hand it in. And we hope it's correct. And while we're waiting, we will pick up another handcuff. Alright. Close this. Was it correct? Yes! Nice. Awesome. Got it. Easiest, easiest case ever. So we have the hardest case and the easiest case all together. Very nice. Ooh, what did we get for social credit seven? Let's see. Visiting your apartment will grant removal of basic negative status apartment uh, effects. Okay. All right. Well. What else do we got? We should probably get an apartment. Um, 4,300, 1,200. Um, hmm. What should we do? Lesser Gatto building. These are all pretty cheap. This one's a little expensive, but it's on the third floor. We could theoretically afford it. We've got enough right now. Maybe. Alright, no frills apartment for a business go-getter. Kensington Indigo preferred. Uh, I think we could do this. Alright, so let's go ahead and purchase this. We'll get us an apartment. 304. Let's make sure we don't have our key under the door. We do have our key under the door. Why do we have our key under the door? This is our apartment now. Nice. Lock. Alright. What is our apartment? Very nice. Why do we have all the clothes on the floor, though? Wait, this is our apartment, right? Oh, yeah, yeah, okay. So we have our own... T we can update our own information. Uh, okay, this is bad. <laughs> Don't look at my financial skies. <laughs> That's really interesting. Let's see. Uh, I don't even know. That's very interesting. Uh, okay. That is so cool that you can update your own information like that. That's super cool. Alright, close that. And now we actually have our own computer that we can work with. I really don't know why all these clothes are around though. That's kind of weird. 
but that is so cool. We have a nice little bed. I'm assuming all of these are in, wait, we have money in here? We have money in our drawer? I mean, yes, this is my house. I can take it. I am free to take it. What do we got over here? Wow, we got a calendar. And we got a bathroom with no toilet. That's gonna cause problem. We got a fridge, guys. And it's got food in it. Wow. This is amazing. This is like, we've even got books on the bookshelves. How cool is this? This is a nice little apartment. All right, we got an address book. Is there anything? We have no, no names. We know nobody, guys. <laughs> We've got a screwdriver and a wrench. This is so cool. We have anything in here? Why is there trash in our garbage? You know, in our trash can. We haven't even been here. There's nothing there. Can we like? I wonder if there's a way to like buy uh, how do you buy stuff I wonder for your apartment oh edit decor okay okay so we have 8,000 we got to be careful but can we at least add something in here like uh, bathroom can we do we have some plumbing this is um can we, like, buy some, like, a toilet? Yes. <laughs> that looks a lot better. Okay. So we spent a little bit of money. But I think, uh... I think that looks good. Oh, we need a sink, right? So we need to get, uh, a sink. And then I think we'll be done in the bathroom for now. Alright. I think that's okay. Now we can open it up. Is there a way? We need a... I want a light there, though still very dark I don't know I don't like how dark it is here but it's okay everything else looks really cool I'm pretty happy with this place it's pretty awesome pretty satisfied with my nice little apartment even the art is not terrible Ooh, I have a TV I have a TV oh my goodness I have a TV I could watch TV instead of doing cases but, yeah, so now we got a cool apartment. I'm pretty happy with it. We got a nice little view. We can see all kinds of stuff. But I think we solved one case, and now we're still waiting for this one to hit. So I think what we'll do next time is um, we'll go hit up the diner, and we will get uh, some more cases, work on some side jobs until our murderer hits again because we investigated everything I could think of. I mean, we could maybe run across a uh, arms dealer. That's about the only thing I can think of, but even that is going to be like investigating in the dark because they're not on the map. So you kind of have to just run across them. Um, we know who the killer is. It's just a matter of finding them and maybe we'll run across them in the process of investigating other things. So we'll just keep an eye out for fingerprint BZ and we're just gonna work some side jobs in the meantime because I don't know where else to look. We've investigated all the neighbors. We did find that one fingerprint on the mailbox but it just led to dead end after dead end. So I, I think at this point there's I don't know what else to do unless we hit a lucky break. So we're just going to check out some other jobs next time. Um, but if you like this kind of content, please make sure to like, subscribe, follow, share, all that good stuff. If you want to watch live or on Twitch at twitch.tv slash 27 I have my schedule posted in the about and in the description. And if you want to see which games I'll be playing each day, I post them on x.com slash 27 And I hope you'll join me in the next one. Until then, guys, bye.